Below State Road 930 is a tunnel. I bring my, my own leaf blower in at times when, the, when, the, when I know the kids aren't coming and I'll blow the dirt and the dust and, and mostly leaves. And a man named Robert Barweiler who takes care of it. Dr. Ken Foes hired Bob shortly after he became superintendent in 2013. I was told about the tunnel, but I was told that the kids don't use the tunnel because it's dirty and, and there's fights happen there and there's uh, smoking and all kinds of things that go on. Bob comes in every morning and afternoon for the students' commute. He put in magnetic lights, cleaned the tunnel's walls, and painted. I spray in the tunnel here with fabulosis. I've worked hard at getting this to smell like this and I like to keep it up. And he makes sure the tunnel is ready for the weather, whatever it might be. Sometimes I, when it's in the middle of the winter and it snows, I get snow that deep in here. I bring my wheelbarrow in, and just like a coal miner, load up the wheelbarrow and wheel it out the other end. He says the reason is simple. I, uh, I like to see that the, that the kids feel safe. The tunnel was built in the late 40s. Bob used it on the football team in the 60s. It was really, really nice. In fact, they had lights all the way through it, which we used to hit our helmets on it when we'd run through the tunnel. He says that's part of the reason he has such pride. By cleaning it up, people have a little more respect for the area when they come through. Since Bob has been here at the tunnel, uh, foot traffic has increased. Bob says he'll do this for at least a few more years. We would like all of our employees that we hire to have the attributes that Bob has. He's so conscientious and he's so caring. Um, and you know what uh, really makes uh, somebody who works in the school business successful is the genuine caring relationships that they establish with the students. And Bob has that. He really cares about the kids. He cares about them so much that he does all these extra things on his own because he wants to do that for the kids. In New Haven, Gina Galeros, News Channel 15.